Hi there, this is Al from GamingGeek.net and today we're going to take a look at X-Men the official game, uh, the NTSC U version, this is the PlayStation release and we're playing it on the Retroid Pocket 4 Pro and I'm using Ether SX2 version 1.4 something, the version number will be in the video description, right, so, um, well, if you take, take a look at my channel, you'll see that I'm quite fond of uh, superhero games, right? I, it's not the only game that I feature, of course, um, but I feature a lot of them, and I missed out on a lot of these uh, PlayStation 2, GameCube era superhero games, um, because when they came out, uh, you know, decades ago, two decades around that time, um, I wasn't into uh, video games. All right. Oh man. All all dark screens. Hard to get a get a good um, shot. All right. Here you go. Um, so yeah, I've been revisiting superhero games, and actually, I'm just gonna say this. If in case you watched all three episodes that I released this week, right? Um, it's actually all X games this week uh, although not not the way you'd expect it right uh, just check out my channel i have uh final fantasy x2 and then zeno saga and then finally here now yeah uh, this, since this is the intro i'll just be quick we'll go into the retroid profile that i'm uh, using so that is a uh, high performance oh why is my fan off that's weird all right Sometimes it turns off on its own, but yeah, high performance and s smart for fan, right? Now for Ether SX2, there are a couple of tweaks that I recommend that you do when you try this game out. So just go into general, press o set optimal settings. Then don't do anything in system. For graphics, change GPU renderer to Vulkan. You can change upscale multiplier to 2x. And then uh, make sure threaded presentation is checked, right? So this game runs better uh, in Vulkan. Uh, audio, make sure interpolation is Gaussian and synchronization is time stretch. All right. So now we can finally talk about the, the game. Uh, yeah, why, why do I like uh, X-Men, uh, the official game? So it's actually strange because it says... X-Men, the official game, but you also have Wolverine's Claws, you know, marking three, right? So it's confusing. Is this X-Men 3 or what? But this actually, uh, this game is in between X2 and uh, X-Men 3, The Last Stand. Uh, no, saving, cancel, save, yes. Um, what I'm talking about, of course, are the Fox uh, X-Men movies. Right, uh, which put uh, Hugh Jackman in the role of Wolverine. So uh, he's back in, in uh, the Wolverine role for Deadpool and Wolverine. So hopefully, you don't you don't you haven't forgotten about this uh, uh, franchise, right? It's been a long time since um, we had a good X Men movie. If you don't count Deadpool, I'm just trying to wait a second. Gameplay invert. I want invert at, um, for all axes. Video subtitles. Game subtitles. Yeah, I don't like widescreen, so we're not gonna do widescreen. And I just want to be consistent, right? Uh, I'm not doing widescreen for anything, so except Dreamcast. All right, I think we're good, so we can go ahead and start. I mean, the the X Men. Uh, let's read this. Wolverine is still grieving over Jean Grey's death. He he thinks the danger will provide a diversion from his anguish because nothing takes his mind off his problems like a good fight. Yeah, this this again in between. What was the name? X X two, X Men United, right? X, X Men two, where uh, Jean Grey died at the end, right? Trying to save them. Um, 
and before uh, X Men Three: The Last Stand. So this explains why Nightcrawler was in X Two, but not in X Men Three, right? And okay, you know, just uh, do it. And I'm gonna choose Novice because uh, I just want to get as far into the game as possible, right? Uh, in an hour or so. So I don't want to get stuck or, you know, have to repeat sections because I'm dying. Now, um, yeah, so aside from not just being a tie-in, but actually uh, bridging the two movies together, right? Filling in the gaps. Uh, you play as Wolverine, Iceman, and Nightcrawler in this game, right? They, they're, they have different missions. They have a mutation tree that's Cyclops. Doesn't look like uh, um, Cyclops from the movie though. The human race has adapted, evolved to become the top of the food chain. Now, I tried this out on the Red Red Pocket 3 Plus, and I did get to get it to run at a playable uh, performance, but there were issues in, during cutscenes. I think the audio would uh, repeat something like that. And there were some uh, sections wherein it would still dip. I, I forgot actually, but performance is playable, but could have been better. Too dark. Anyhow, um, he's the beast is distracting me. Um, yeah, the performance wasn't very good on the three plus, so I wanted to revisit it on the retro pocket four pro. And I guess um, aside from bridging the two movies, right and. Uh, Letting you control Nightcrawler, Iceman, and Wolverine. When have we gotten a good 3D uh, X-Men game? Right? Think about it. Um, I mean, we had we have the classic X-Men games. We had X-Men Legends and X-Men Legends Two, which are 3D games, but more of an action RPG. But for X Men, like there was a Deadpool game, I remember that, um, and the X Men are in Marvel vs. Capcom games, but nothing that, that um, nothing like uh, the Sony Spider Man games uh, on various PlayStation uh, devices. Nothing like uh, even just the even before those uh, uh, Spider Man games, right? And we don't, nothing like uh, the Batman Arkham Asylum games, or even Marvel's Avengers, or, you know, Guardians of the Galaxy. So, you know, if, if you want uh, an X-Men game, right, you, you won't do bad with this one. Oop. Let me just uh, adjust the lighting, though, I think it's a little dark. Defeat Sabretooth. Continue. I don't even remember uh, Sabretooth. This, this version of Sabretooth. Uh, the Tyler Main version. Speaking in the movies. The metrics of the game are in the upper right. So there is some glitching here on the left. On um, the right, sorry, that usually happens when you're upscaling. Uh, not now. You when it happens, it's because you're upscaling. So, but it's not too bad. Sometimes there's just light bleeding uh, there. All right, we're heal up. There you go. See, Wolverine can re retract his claws. Has his healing factor. That's uh, The only thing uh, I the only thing it would have 
Well, don't want to see the only thing. One thing that uh, would have made this better is... Oh, look at that frame rate dip. Is if... There's an enemy here. Oh, that's a uh, saber tooth. All right. Is if you, Jack, when uh, I'll lend, lend his voice. Definitely not you, Jack, when uh, voicing Wolverine in this game. So again, this is just a danger room simulation. Alright, you, you also see that glitching sometimes here at the bottom of the screen. You can also, you can also jump. This game uh, does have some replayability. Because uh, it has a branching path, so later I will see an example of uh, where it branches. There's this combo that I'm fond of. That headbutt, because you know, two hits knocks enemies out. <laughs> if you hit with the, the two hits, right? There, see? Very efficient. Alright, let's see what movie. Yeah, I, I'm on novice mode, so I, I know. If this is going to be uh, very easy, but later, let's see later, right? Okay. Let's fight. Fury mode. Now th again, this isn't limited to Wolverine, N Nightcrawler, and Iceman. Also have their uh, sequences. Oh, you're challenging me, huh? Ooh. It won't allow us to heal. Well, just go berserk. Oh, what? I was go trying to go for the fury attack. A little disappointing. It does sound a little bit like you, Jackman, but definitely not you, Jackman. It's a pretty 
pretty close uh, impression, I'd say. Iceman's far off. But yeah, now we're going to see there. So here, this is what I'm talking about, where there's like a mutation. Uh, it's not a tree. It doesn't look like a tree, but it, it is like a tree where you can uh, increase stats, right? Um, blocking strength, of course, let's increase combat damage, right? Continue. Yes. No. Cancel save. And now we're gonna do so here it doesn't show the branch yet, but later there it's gonna start to branch and there are missions that uh, you have you have to choose which one to to do and then later you have to go back into the game and you know finish what what you missed right so the game will even tell us right earlier. Um, that we can replay missions at different difficulty levels, right? So when, when I choose this, there's a difficulty level. Every time you start a mission, you're going to choose a difficulty level. So as your characters grow stronger uh, through the mutations that you unlock, uh, then that will allow you to handle the more difficult versions of the levels uh, a little bit more easier, easily. Okay. There you go. How to break R1. Did we miss a few there? Yep, looks like it. Pretty neat, right? Meh. I mean, Iceman is like one of the founding members of the X-Men in the comic books. Um, I don't remember that he's actually had an action game. He's rarely uh, a playable character in action games. So. I think there. I think this uh, X. Uh, the, well, what were we doing? The Game Boy Advance version of this game actually has Iceman as a playable character. I remember that uh, he's got a really good far-reaching um, move that I like. That was also a good game, by the way, the Game Boy Advance version of this. Because uh, you were able to play as Nightcrawler, Iceman, Wolverine... And Colossus. I think Colossus was a playable character. So, two underutilized characters from the movies uh, and Wolverine and Nightcrawler. Nightcrawler, I wouldn't call him underutilized because he had a. Oh, no. Shoot, but don't forget they can shoot back. You get into trouble. Form an ice shield to block incoming fire. Do you have someone from the left? Yeah. This is just a danger room simulation. Imagine... How much more it would be if, you know... Oh, it's gone. Oh! That's fast. Oh, wait a second, where? There's some enemies.
That's weird. You know what, we're... I don't think that we're gonna run out of enemies, right? It just keeps spawning, so... There you go, training session complete. That is weird. Um, there you go. Then we, we we will be able to. Oh wait. Okay. What do you want, Chuck? I realize it has been difficult for you to deal with Gene's death, but setting the danger room on level ten is dangerous even for a mutant of your talents. Well, thanks for the advice. I'm gonna be a completely different person now. Can you come to my office, please? I have a better use for your abilities. What did I miss? As you know, I've been trying to use Cerebro to track Magneto's movements, but have been unsuccessful so far. Many of the components strike or remove were irreplaceable. And we left those parts back at... Alkali Lake. That's right. I realize Alkali Lake holds difficult memories for us all. But we need those parts if we ever hope to stop Magneto. Right, see, so, so that's how it, it ties into the second game. Because we, we keep getting hit, I'm just going to choose increase health for... No. Alright, what's our next? Alkali Lake, yeah, so... So let's see what this mission is all about. Nightcrawler and the rest of the X-Men return to Alkali Lake. There. Hearts of the X-Men are heavy as they near the scene of Jean's death. So, yep. Novice, and I remember getting stuck in one of the Nightcrawler stages. So let's hope I don't get stuck here. We should be there any minute. So the the soundtrack, uh, For some reason, there looks uh, very much like Halle Berry. Oh yeah, I remember Colossus is in this game too, but he's not a playable character. So is Storm. So it's really actually like uh I can't get around from the past unless someone can get inside and deactivate. I got it. I can't get you close enough. I can do it. It's too dangerous. I can't let you. I keep getting my I got like uh, distracted by the cutscene, but yeah, see, um, if you like the first two X Men movies and you know you want to see more of the underutilized uh, X Men characters like uh, Iceman and Colossus and even Nightcrawler, okay, let's let's call Nightcrawler underutilized because he only he was the only part of the X Men for one Looks one like movie, no one right? All right, now it's a infiltration mission. Right, see?
Hmm. Oh, there's like, there's this blue thing. Ooh. Wait a second, I think I made a mistake. Crud. Alright. Nice, alright. So, we're here. Where am I supposed to go? See, it's easy to get stuck here. Oh. It's a top part for the pole, so I'm going to pole. There you go. Uh, even though uh, Nightcrawler is all about infiltration and stealth, you know, he's got a pretty good ouch. Ow. Okay, Shadow Aura. Did you get all that? Combat is uh, fun with Nightcrawler, to be honest. So if you're a fan of the character, right? Um, wait for our enemies. No, let's go. exit, man. What? There you go, that was quick. But yeah, if you wanted uh, uh, a Nightcrawler game, this is, you play as Nightcrawler in a lot of these uh, missions in uh, X-Men, the official game, so. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, I'm quite high on this. Increase health pool, increase ground attack. So let's say decrease the aura pool down. And the connections between the, the levels is very um very logical, right? So now uh we're gonna do another nightcrawler level. So we st after the danger room missions, we start with Nightcrawler trying to get, um, trying to get the rest of his team uh, inside Alkali Base, Alkali Lake Base. So what do you call this?
Right now, I got stuff. Uh, what did you do? I show major activity in your area. Looks like I drew a little too much attention to myself. Well, then stick to the shadows from here on out if you can. We'll be there soon. Of course not. We're, um, we're going to have fun in this level. I think uh, Wolverine and Nightcrawler are the mo more utilized characters in this game with, with uh, Iceman appearing less frequently because Night because Iceman's uh, stage is really uh, him on the ice slides. All right. An X-Men game would be great, right? And when I say X-Men game, like, um, with multiple members of the X-Men, not just, not just Wolverine or what. And, uh, I loved, uh, the X-Men, uh, what are we supposed to do? Shut down the generators and go to the control room. Where are the generators? I don't know where your generators are, okay. I'm gonna play this game for real. Hmm, this acts the... All right, now I'm I'm getting entertained. Um, hmm. Actually, I like playing as Nightcrawler more than I do uh, Wolverine uh, in this game. Right. Okay, let's get these generator panels online. How do we do that? Oh, man, me not paying attention to my uh, radar, right? Let's go to war attention. Defend the generator. Nice going, Nightcrawler. Okay, yeah, I remember um, when I uh, did my uh, Redford Pocket 3 Plus test for this game. I took me a, uh, it was a long episode, I'll say that. I'll get that first. Five out of five. All right. I'm not, not sure what that unlocks, but uh, we're just one one fewer, right? First generator is off. Just one more to go. One more to go. All right. Well, let's heal up. All right. Protect the console. 
Oh. Nightcrawler's almost broken, right? Alright, everyone down. Open the exit door. How? All right. Well, there's a. Where? Uh, not there apparently. Look at that man, so fun. And yeah, I'm so happy. Look at the how uh, I know it's novice difficulty, but also the pacing of the missions, right? Like we've seen several already, and for just over thirty minutes. Like take care of yourself. I don't know if I'm cut out for this, though. It goes against my peaceful nature. Yeah, sure it does. Kurt, I hate to ask more of you, but I need you and Colossus to recover the psychic interlink and the core emotion filter. Our missing cerebro components. The what? Ocean filter? You're making those names up, right? Logan and I will find out who these soldiers are and what they're doing here. There, so Nightcrawler and Colossus split, um, pairing up, right? They have their own missions, and Storm and uh, Wolverine, they have their own mission. Emotion filter, I wonder what that means. All right, we already had the uh, healing, so relocation attack chain, jump attack damage, ground attack damage. Ground attack damage sounds nice. All right, what's the next mission? Oh no. All right, if we... Alkali Labs, I think we can't backtrack. We have to choose one. So it's either Nightcrawler or Wolverine, right? Oof, tough choice. Yeah, here. This looks like a long stretch. We'll do the long stretch. Wolverine once again returns to the place where the night works, blah, blah, blah. All right, so we'll do Wolverine. You okay? Hey, it's this place. I don't like being this far underground. It upsets my powers. You are claustrophobic. No, I'm not. Don't worry, Storm. I'm good at keeping secrets. Here it is. This should reroute power to the machine. Oh, we're gonna miss out on uh, there's this really fun Nightcrawler um, boss fight with a Sentinel, with Sentinels, and we're gonna miss out on that. Um, hey, but I chose this, so we'll do, we'll do this. Be sure to take advantage. L three activate Storm's lightning attack. Oh, there's Storm. Logan, we need to destroy those transformers. The machine is using them to regulate its power level. Without them, it will overload. Okay. Oh, 
Ouch. I remember playing through this mission though. Gotta heal up when you can, right? I wonder how we can get Storm to attack one of these. I mean the... Now... How many did we collect? Where are the others? Let's go have a look around again. Wow, nice. I will bleed off the power. Hurry up. Destroy it. Man, we were right next to that, and then she, for some reason, this is what she uh, disables. Okay. I can't wait to play this for a real one. This is a, a very nice. I mean, you'll be able to um, control Wolverine and Storm. All right, yeah. Good luck. Good luck uh, faring well against uh, Berserker mode. Now how about some um, Generator Destruction Storm? Quickly. 
All right, all done. We've done it. Get clear. Get clear. All right. I remember that that mission. So if we did this, hmm. Oh no. Logan! <laughs> You're obsolete, old man. Who are you? You can call me Death Strike. Now oh, look at that boss fight. I wonder if I could survive this. I don't remember how this uh, goes. Maybe, maybe when I see it, uh, I'll know. But yeah, look at that. Uh, Marvel tying up um, Hydra, right? Um, in the X-Men movie, in the X-Men film franchise. There, so we can't choose those missions because we already chose this path. Oh, 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 oh. All right, here you go. So we'll take on, yeah, and then, and I'm not sure if you noticed, but at the side of each um, stage, in the stage selection, you have like a three bar meter. So it'll tell you, it will tell you how, which difficulty you've already beaten a uh, level in. So yeah. Go ahead and try. No storm uh, helped here though. So this uh, linear, right? But um, Seriously, or someone? All right. Nice touch, though, right? Um. Heal. Let's heal. Why can't I heal? All right, maybe I'm too full of rage. before they
Wow. They're surprisingly tough. I can heal up here. Should be safe. Okay, where should I be going next? Nothing. Oh, here. All right. We're in. Wow. Hey, look at the. He used the rocket launcher as a melee weapon. All right. Maybe I'll uh, visit you guys. Right. Shooting from behind a wall. I haven't found anything. All right, um, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna find. I'm not gonna um, make the effort to find all those. Right. Uh, I'm crashing your party. Sure. I remember this. You're the ones who shoot. Who were shooting at me earlier? Ooh. Alright, thank goodness for uh, healing, right? Alright, finally found one of these. So healing, at least for all three of them, right? It, they regenerate health um, normally, right? Just just by time. So it doesn't look like there's any uh, healing items uh, in this game. So, I might have missed one already by not destroying the boxes that I was encountering. Maybe one of the uh, chips were hidden in one of those uh, boxes. Alright, too many. Nice enemy variety too, right? You have these uh, fighters with claw-like weapons. And then you have uh, weapons uh, with, with spears. Spears, sorry. Um, you have the ones with uh, guns. Ooh. Gotta learn how to block. Oh no. We try. Oh no. Are we gonna do that from the beginning or? No, good thing. Whew. Still a little bit uh, far. Yeah, quite a bit uh, behind there. 
I'm gonna make it fast though. At least I didn't have to start from the beginning. That would have been uh, painful. I'm crashing your party. Yeah, it's weird that uh, they're being called Hydra, right? Hydra in an X-Men game. I'm already fully healed up, so... All right, let's do better. Oh no, yeah. I think this is it. I'll be more careful. Man, can't believe I got beat in the novice, huh? Wow, dude, these guys are not, um, not playing. Wow. All right, let's try that again. Wow. Those scythe guys. You gotta learn how to deal with them. <laughs> gotta handle the scythe the spear guy sorry not scythe with urgency right I can already kill these gunners into a claw attacks. Alright, let's go inside here. Man, I didn't Can you believe it took me several tries here? Alright, let's move forward. More boxes in the way, so we're gonna open those. Oh. I like it when he said that. The tables have indeed turned and we're just gonna... Alright, so yeah, we definitely miss out on some of those chips. Huh. 
I wonder what the next mission is gonna be. Uh, definitely upgrading uh, Wolverine's health next time. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I'm definitely gonna play this for real. Uh, their increased health pool will take that lock mutation, cancel save. Testing center. Oh, we're bent on rescuing Storm. So we're, uh, ooh. After we beat this, we're gonna get two, um, two unlocks. Okay. I think this is a good, um, way to end the mission. Oh man. Oh no. I'm like, I've been really quiet, right? Because. Oh man, I wasted my. Uh... Oh man, I think that the, it's... Uh, ooh. Stay away from Dosa. Oh man. Oof, wow. Because the enemies can block too, and that's what's uh, pretty annoying about them. Come on, heal up. Yeah, see, look at that. He survived. My goodness. <laughs> oh, look at that. Ooh.
definitely not a good idea to. Oh, even saying, oh, you know what? Oh man, it got caught. Oof. You know what? I'll just. Did he pass that test or what? I don't know how many of those uh, you're going to see, but that took me a long, uh, so many attempts. Wait, let's go back. Can we still go back? Not anymore? Oh, not anymore. Alright. Oh, wow. So many enemies. All right, yeah, this is a completely different route. I'm gonna um, oh, look at that! See, all they had to do is have the their freaking um, sticks right in front of them. And, you know, they're already defending against you.
They won't even give me the chance to heal. There's a lot more. I don't know why R2 is not working. This might be the game that will break my R2. Okay, so I'm going to have to cut a lot of those out. That was a pretty difficult mission. Which makes me want to increase the healing rate. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, 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 regress. This is probably, um, closes his, uh, closes, ah, uh, closes in on his quarry, so, uh, Wolverine's about to rescue Storm. I'm not sure if I can beat her, but. And again, uh, this is a totally different way uh, how I ended. Uh... Ooh. Does she even have a weakness? Why am I the one getting knocked into the hurricane? This badass style. Oh, cool. There you go. Both of us. He's happy about it. All right. Chill, Storm. I think this is going to be easier than...
All right, let's try this one. Oh man. Yeah, because she's only one enemy, uh, I find her easier to deal with than, you know, those hordes of uh, soldiers earlier. See, I think I've got her. I wonder how more, much more difficult this is if this wasn't an office. Alright, finally. Did I get the chance to heal? Heal up. At least Storm, you know, unconscious, unconsciously. Uh, has been helping us thanks to that like hurricane. Ugh. Yeah, and then the, the moment I say say it, right? Oh, I. Uh... I actually just want to trigger my uh, rage meter. Come on, kill her. Oh, there you go. Whew. That's a, a different, you know, fanfare. to end this episode right um uh, boss fight with wolverine lady death strike now um uh, the, the action has been so intense uh, i've been seeing the metrics uh, go red and green right every now and then how many do we have 
combat damage, block rotations. Um, yeah, it's been going down. Um, but it's, I never felt uh, it, you know, become terrible, right? Wait. Yeah, so it, once you've... Oh, here you go. So after you've done a path, uh, you can go back. Or do you have to do... Oh, you have to do the other path. So it's branching, but it's not alternate, right? So... Yeah, I think that's the reason why the Storm and Wolverine mission was familiar to me. Do you hear that? The whispering. It's getting louder. I don't hear anything. Stop it! You want me to die? No, I... I didn't mean to... Jason Stryker, right? It's nothing. Let's keep moving. I can't break it. Maybe I can disable it from inside. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine. I'll have you inside in a moment. There you go. So, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to wait for this to load before I close it. So, that's why the, the storms and the Wolverine sequence from earlier, where we had to destroy the generators, uh, was familiar. I think I tried that out after the Nightcrawler missions, but... Yep, this is the Nightcrawler mission Here, and there's some kind of field protecting the door. You'll need to get to the override to let me in. This uh, this actually is a long mission, so uh we won't go, go through it, but I'm going to start concluding uh this episode. Yeah. X-Men the official game, right? Uh released on the PlayStation 2. I think there's also a, a GameCube version, just not sure about Xbox. But uh, plays really well on the Retro Pocket 4 Pro. What's that? Using the. Come on, Oof. <laughs> Using Ether SX2, right? I'm playing the NTSC version. And uh, like what I said earlier, uh, I see the metrics, the numbers go red occasionally, right? But I never felt it. Uh, to be terrible right or never actually felt it at all here you go now I found it quicker so very very playable right and uh, like I said at the start of the video um there's not a lot of modern X-Men games available for us to play. So if you want to play as a Wolverine and Nightcrawler and a little bit of Iceman, this is a game that's uh, worth uh, revisiting. Right? Destroy shield units. Where are they? Oh no. There's one outside. But we won't complete that. I'm just going to run around here. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, check out my other X games. Uh, game tests that I did. Xenoblade, sorry, Xenosaga and uh, Final Fantasy X 2, right, on the channel. And, yeah, if you have game requests uh, for PlayStation 2 right now, uh, let me know and I'll consider uh, testing your request. Sometimes it's too difficult or too obscure that I, I don't get interested. But yeah, just reach out, leave a comment, and hope you uh, check out more of my videos. Once again, this is Al from TheGamingGeek.net. Talk to you in the next video. Uh, there, it took me a while to get back to this. Where's the shield control units there? this right you have an enemy behind you or I'll just get rid of that enemy and let's let's just do this and then voila